Welcome back, everybody. We're doing a nice little follow-up to the uh, Had a Full Boyfriend game, because I got sick with birds, so let's cook them now. Uh, yep, that's right. We're playing I Love You, Colonel Sanders, a finger-licking good dating simulator. Uh, the game uh, are here and going to melt my brain a little bit more um, with another insane, crazy, stupid, what-the-hell-am-I-thinking game. Uh, so let's just go ahead and do this now. So, new game. Uh, I need to enter a name here, so... Yeah. Exactly how I feel. And you gotta admit, the uh, for stupid little drawn drumsticks and biscuits, those look pretty appetizing, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, maybe I shouldn't have eaten this, played this game on a hungry stomach. I should have eaten something uh, before, so whatever. Uh, so here we are with the crazy chicken poster above my bed, the hearts in the window, and what I think is a KFC box in front of my computer monitor there. Um, again, because I don't want my brain to melt so quickly, I'm not going to be reading the dialogue. Uh, so if you actually enjoy reading that, um, yeah, do your own thing. So we're just going to go through here until I have to make a decision. And uh, then I'll make the decision and move on to the next thing. Oh, God, and there's the rooster crowing. Oh, let's smack that clock up and at him. The University of Cooking School Academy for Learning. And it's prestigious. Oi. My mind is already wondering, why the hell am I doing this to myself? Uh, yeah, I should probably take this more seriously, even though I don't know if I can. That's the kind of game this is. Oh, uh, pits deodorized. Yeah, nothing can stop me now. Except for maybe my brain melting. <laughs> really doing a good job of advertising the biscuits. This is the cooking school, eh? Alright, let's just go with it. Let's just go with it. Oh, my lifelong best friend. Oh, she's really getting into this with that whole kitchen outfit, that chef outfit. Um... <laughs> yes, good morning, dead inside. Nope. Nope, not even going to get a word in edgewise from my best friend, am I? Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh. Uh, if she raised herself to... If she holds herself to high standards, she wouldn't be in this game. Oh god, rescued in that quicksand box. It's like how I rescued the bird that I fell in love with in the last game. Wait, three day only semesters? Really? Well, I mean, it's gotta be a short game at least, because, you know, it's all about dating Senpai Sanders. Oh, kissing on a mannequin. Oh, let's pep talk. That's pep talk. Any of the mask who gave me nightmares. Oh, uh, destined for great things. If you're destined for great things, you wouldn't go to a school holding three days semesters. Oh. Uh, yeah, well, guess what? You're not going to get the colonel because the colonel is mine. The colonel is mine, do you hear me, Miriam? Mine! Yeah, those bangs are so killer, it looks like they could stab someone to death. They're so pointy! Yeah, I can believe you cut them yourself. I can completely believe that. And look, so can my character. <laughs> yeah, that's about the reaction I'd have. Custom engraved measuring spoons. 
Oh, here come the bullies. Oh, right. Um, apparently she's part vampire with that one tooth right there. I mean, yeah. And that is the craziest smelling of Ashley I have ever seen. Okay, there we go. So she did add the... Right. Really weird insults. Van Van the Man Man. I'm really... I'm really doing this to myself? I'm really doing this to myself? Okay. Alright. We'll, we'll do this. Um... I can't be the only one that thinks that Ashley looks like a Pokemon villain right now with those eyes and that grin. Oh. My. God. What. The. Hell. I am mesmerized. Oh my god, it gets worse when you see his full body. Um. Okay. Alright, we'll do this. We'll deal with this. Um. Okay. Alright. Yeah, uh, points for anyone who guessed as soon as Van Van showed up, um, as to when my brain melted, so. Yep. Yep. Let's go. Unfortunately, I know these two are going to be on my screen quite often. Oh my god, what the hell is that? Okay, I think we've hit every anime stereotype so far. Well, except for one, but because of stuff I saw in previews for this game, I know that one's coming too. So, yeah. Yeah, I think we've hit every... Almost, I think we're going to hit every anime stereotype in this game. Oh, God. Yeah, please just mean thank you instead. <laughs> oh god, what an idiot. And I don't know whether I mean Pop slash Bob or myself for playing this. Oh god. It's just you, Miriam. It's just you. Oh. Bucket of chicken, triangle, world map. Yep, okay. We're going there. And here's the other anime stereotype I was talking about. A dog is your teacher. Oh, yep, that's every anime stereotype. So I think we've got it covered now. Fairly sure we've got it all. Oh, wait, no, one more and it's coming. And he's the CEO. He's the CEO of the school. Oh my god. Professor Dog. Alright then. Uh huh. Here's the final stereotype. Here it comes. No, I don't mean pop again. Here it comes. There we go. The abnormally uh, supposed to be handsome man who's actually a teenage version of an old man. Um, yeah, that that is totally right. Right. Okay. <clears throat> yep. 
please call me Colonel. Colonel Sanders. Oh, God. I mean, you got to love KFC for putting this out just for the massive advertising and people like me that are going to be stupid enough to play it. Uh, so, yeah. Yeah, there we go. And there's the animated stereotype villains again. I almost, in a sad way, I wish this voice was uh, voice acted. I really do. Because I almost want to hear Miriam saying these things. of Cooking School Academy for Learning, the greatest culinary academy in the world. I mean, if a name like that in three-day semesters, how can it be not? There will be blood. Really adorable tiny food. Oh. You will lift your sporks and compete in the broom cooking arena. Okay, I guess there was one more stereotype. <sighs> and there's Angry Dog. <laughs> oh, stupid NTCs and PCs. Yes. <laughs> Because of course there is an industrial kitchen appliance student at the school. Why would there? Oh my god, what the hell am I looking at? Um, if my brain wasn't melted already, it sure is now. Considering this is for KFC, a chicken company, I'm going to go with the chicken snack. Bribing the teacher. Gee, what a surprise. The chicken snack was his favorite. Warm doggy jewel. And that's actually a good lesson in life right there, to carry various dog, dog snacks on you at all times. You're never going to meet a friendly dog that needs a cookie. Uh, let me guess, one of them is going to be by my best friend, and one of them is going to be by Colonel Sanders. Oh gee, what a surprise. because the goal is to bang Colonel Sanders, I'm going to sit by the Colonel. Mm. Oh, right. Because that is, yeah, so inspiring. Quiz already. <laughs> I should have seen that coming. All right, I guess I've got some uh, options to make coming up here.
Why do I have to make fun of Pop? I didn't want to make fun of Pop. I mean, yeah, but... Yeah, because night vision goggles go well with a chicken. Well, it's gotta be a spork. For a broken heart, anything, as long as it's prepared with love and not too much salt. I don't know why camel meat would be an option, but... Yeah, talking dog teacher of culinary school, he is the best boy. Perfect score! Woohoo! Who saw that coming? Uh, did I cheat? No, those were just stupid questions. Oh, yay, that was hearts coming out from behind Sen Senpai Sanders. Another important announcement to make. Ooh, this is definitely, definitely, definitely a, uh, definitely a more important thing. Crazy good. Ooh, there goes uh, no name again. He's not going to get to the end of it all game, is he? <sighs> oh god, why do I have a feeling fried chicken is coming in? Oh no. Yep. There we go. There's the bucket of fried chicken. Did not see that coming. Uh, I feel warm and safe because of the smell of fried chicken. Because of course. Because of course. And of course it's a novel concept. the advertisement. Senpai Sanders. <laughs> I'm really not sure what bothers me the most about Van Van. going to be sucking up to. Now there's nothing about that that screams sweet and innocent. Mm. Mm. Okay, I've decided it's the star for the hair that bothers me the most about Van Van. Totally the star for her. Yep, there we go. Transports me to another dimension. Oh. 
I'm going to focus my mind. <laughs> deeper, deeper. It's exactly what she's probably saying to Colonel Sanders. <laughs> Even deeper still until you find it. Ooh. Ooh, they even block out the thing. Oh, God. I know the secret flavor. Mwah! Mwah! Oh, God. I guess I approach Colonel Sanders, because there's no other option. That's the most disgusted look I've ever seen on a... What, what the hell? Uh... Oh. You can feel his warm breath. Blank. It's something my great grandmother taught me. I'm gonna be honest, folks, I'm not even really reading half these things. Uh, let's be modest. Why is this like the the pose? I mean, like every third screen, he seems to be on that pose. Oh, uh, now I feel like I'm on some crazy uh, Food Network show. Tiny food creations. That should be interesting. I pounce on Colonel Sanders.
I don't think he owes anything. Warp, warp, warp. Basic dish and divide up the steps, huh? Well, let's see. So the basic thing, and the only basic thing here would be mashed potatoes and gravy. Plus, this is a Colonel Sanders game, a KFC game, so mashed potatoes and gravy is just seems like the obvious answer. Is that his go-to pose? Why is why? What the hell am I doing to myself? I am a drumstick, it just makes sense. I got turned to the hunk of hunks. It is Colonel Sanders. Oh, okay, it's kind of kind of sad this place, it's starting to bother me. Oh, yeah, I definitely shouldn't have played this game on an empty stomach. Really? Really? Oh, God. Stand still. Oh god, he's gonna say that right before he lets go of the spork, isn't he? Goodbye!
Is it more ever it lands? Can I house potatoes, please? Well, all right then, uh, Mr. Overdoing It. Poison. <laughs> oh god, Pop. I'm dead student. You're the CEO. You make the most money of all the professors. Yes, please, Colonel Sanders. Walk me home. Walk me home, Daddy. Dark and more than a little bit spooky. No, it looks like just any old college campus at night. We're going to make out at night on the quad now. Yes, do it. Do it. I want to jump your drumstick. Uh -huh. Of course, Van Van, the man man, pops in and ruins the perfectly beautiful evening. Oh, jeez. Yep. Indeed. Oh. And yet you made that hairstyle, so... Yeah, whose fault is that really now? Oh. You're already the star of the story with that star on your hair. You... Hmm. <laughs> oh, dear God. Oh my god, what the hell? What the hell am I playing right now, even? I'm fighting a sport monster now. I'm fighting a fucking sport monster. Um, right. As a matter of fact, I think this is the perfect place to stop part one, and uh, I'll pick up from here in part two, so. Alright, make sure to like, share, and subscribe, and hit that bell notification bell, bell icon so you get notifications when part two comes out. Um, because as if part one wasn't uh, bad enough, um, part two is probably going to be worse. So the gamer are here signing off, and uh, enjoy those games. <laughs>